So let's just quickly find the right broadcast. So I have that ready. Oh, there's some lovely people commentating these grand finals and such. Yeah, so. Week 19 was an interesting tournament. This is. Um, a, like a few days after uh, the patch. Um, so. I have we throw this on and have a look at the bracket. Uriel Legion, just or Barry Bones. Excellent. So. The matches we'll watch. Winners finals. Barry Bones versus Uriel Legion. Great match. Loser semi-finals. Jester versus Sin. And grand finals. Uriel versus Jester. Uh, Loser's finals didn't happen. Uh, I'll explain that when we come to it. Excellent. So... Let's have a look here. Um, this again, yeah, new patch. We have new air movement. Axel has been nerfed into the ground, I hear. Uh, Axel sucks now, apparently. I don't know what people are talking about. Axel seems pretty good. We have Barry Huesos against Dural Legion. Um, Barry is repping Spain due to, I think, being there in this point in time after the Red Bull Gladiators tournament. Um... I don't know. Barry Huesos, I'm not asking questions. So, in week 18, we just looked at, like, Euro Legion strategy against the Axles. And that is, like, the kind of whiff punishing type thing. But again, Barry Bones is a very aggressive Axle. But he, of course, adjusts his style to, like, be able to combat Nagaryuki. Picks it. Good. Barry Huesos with the first round. That's very nice. Going low. Good. 2H. Here we go, baby. So. Again, this is the like, same thing of Ural just jumping forward while holding back. Ah, oh, the Fukio back there to get a punish him. So again, this is on the new patch, right? So, some stuff has changed. Now, I'll point that out when it happens. Okay, I kind of like this goddamn baller move from Barry. Um, so we have a side switch here. So Barry hits a 5p, runs him, then runs forward and does Winter Mantis. Because when the opponent is in the corner, Winter Mantis is a lot easier to hit because you can't see the fucking thing coming. Drops the combo. Yeah, tries for the one vision while he's jumping forward. Like, why not? Like, worst. What's the worst thing that can happen? Yup, and he hits with Orinson. First game goes to Barry Whistles. My Spanish may be a bit rough. That's... That is a fact of life that we'll just have to deal with here. And I have poured myself some more water. Let's go for the next game of Winners Finals here. Oh, berry beans is, makes me happy still. So, Barry had like a pretty good proactive plan here. Gets a gold burst immediately. Run up 2k2d. Like, <laughs> compare this to EX Citizen from the week before. Best anti air in Axel's toolkit, Sickle Storm. God, fuck, I love this man. Um. You're slowly chilling. Stop getting closer. I'll put up buttons. And Barry just fucking willing to run up. That's the 2H. 2H again. That's a Rinsen hit. And Duriel is like high in blood. Yep, that's the command grab hit. Goes for the 5H hit, but doesn't go for the uh, like meaty command grab. Instead, goes for another hit. Good. 
Yep, lovely. Shuke Judy. Man going in. Burst. And he just fucking picks him up. Race the wall to Super. We hear beautiful boys say that we should smell the ocean. We don't. Damn. Predictions be wrong. Like, yeah, this is kind of what he wants to do. He's just kind of a pressing barrier. Jumps over the Winter Mantis. Man, hit the Battle Spirit PRC and. Blocks the sna air snail. Barry's trying to PRC but can't save himself in the air there. Oh my god, round start DP into Fukio. This is a damaging combo. Goes for the BSU, but that's a gold burst. There's a signal storm after the failed meaty. Nope, that was definitely a frame kill. This is a kill. Okay. Yeah, Uriel was just like, nah, you're supering. Okay, we're going on trades with the eruption. Jumping forward. Guess the counter hit, jump slash, and then that lets him pick up an up into a combo. Fine. You are going for six P and Barry winning out. The fuck happened here? Okay, so Barry wins this exchange with the two H. Avoiding the com winter mantis. Okay, he's just jumping and not blocking here, and Uriel t took advantage of it. Axels aren't used to getting NZ out like that, right? That's, yep, six P wins out here. Blocks the burst. Beautiful. Goddamn. Jura Legion is a goddamn murderer. He pops through the rents and the Winter Cherry does get him. Winter Mantis, what do you mean? Super. Tries to punish that super? Yeah. That is so, so minus. Going in. 5H. I actually think, if you can go back and watch this tournament, I think there are some F and grade um, stuff to watch. Because, especially if you like Kai, Kansas matches uh, were interesting. He did some dragon installs that were actually good. Um, counter hit jump age. The fact that he can now pick that up into a combo is so fucked up. BSU. Yeah. And he's just like forcing Barry to respect him. Yeah, drops that combo. Man, Uriel is just. He has the game plan, sends out Battle Spirit, Fukio 2S. He even like finished the combo on the body, it was already input. Like, that's the kind of homo we're talking about here. Battle Spirit in that is now faster and goes full screen. It's so good now. 6k. I actually should do a Nagaryuki playing stream. Oh, we might do that later today. Wait, sorry, what did I hear? Yeah, Dave mentioning in commentary that it, there's a joke that Uriel's Nago has an air dash. I've said that before. I get it. It's true. Like, homie feels like he has a run. Like, it's fucked up. Jesus Christ. Get in. Yeah, after this, we're definitely streaming some strife and just playing Uriel. No, Nago. 
Beautiful. Close last. Close last. Oh, he's not close enough for that mix. Slowly moving forward. I guess again, waiting for Barry to do something risky. Winter Cherry hits, so Yuri is not trying to punish, jumps over the Mantis, and now we're going in. He's back to blocking. Sees the Rainwater, jumps over Renson. Oh, was that a 2 age? Not sure. Yeah, he's blocking. That's the Rainwater. Yeah, jumps over the Renson, goes in for the punish, and Barry bursts. Oh, with BSU randomly. Beyblade in. Block. Just like slowly doing the footsy stuff. Battle Spirit in. PSU, PRC, pop. Close slash, close. He does the goddamn thing again. This is how we finished off um, the stream of uh, week 18 um, thing. He like frame kills with the close slash that he always does before the um, midi close slash and goes for the goddamn throw. There are some pretty people here. We like them. Um, so now we are moving into the. Um, yeah, losers. This is losers semis, but. Um, So, Barry Bones in uh, the Discord wrote, Hey, I am tired as fuck. I am not feeling good. I need to DQ myself. And fucking... Yes, you go, man. Like, I respect that so much. You need to take care of yourself. And I... I really, really admire the, like... The responsibility to take that decision because that is a good thing to do so instead we'll be watching the essentially losers finals but losers semi-final of salty eu jester baby versus sin going with the soul uh sin switches between like chip and soul consistently i feel So, like, yeah, Sin is just trying to focus on defensing and actually punishing Jester right now, I feel. 2k, 2d, this projectile super. Breaks the wall of the hair car. It's Jester. Jump up, jump heavy. I kind of hit jump slash. So. This patch improved Melia a lot. We see an air throw from Sin. So this is Sin's win condition, right? Keep Melia in the corner, run strike throw offense. Where's the five page? And just immediately takes the opportunity to leave the corner. That's a good aggressive burst. Yep. Get the charge dust, 5k for the kill. Oh, side switch fast, let's baby. Blocking, hit, hit by the bad moon, yeah. Goes low, red RC. Good reversal throw there from Sim. Throw from Jester. This is not true. A Sin knows this, but gets thrown. There's the 2H to break the wall. Oh. Yeah. Back PRZs catches him to the landing. Oh, uh, so. I, um... I was watching this um, tournament back with Salen, uh, the lady on commentary here, and talking about it, and fuck, these matches are so good. Um, like, there's so much great play in these. Oh. 
Oh, caught him after that bad burst. Break the wall to dust. Yeah. I assume it was like a mistake or something, but like that happens and you have to have the mental to like keep yourself together and not explode after it, right? Close slash. That's the burst. Super. 2D immediately. Going up. God. Fast fall into couple. This. It's. Man, Milius movement is so cursed now. To get to the, we're setting in a disc, gets the throw. I really need to like study more Milia so I can like better understand what's going on here because it's quite interesting to see. So yeah, we see a combo here from Sin. Going in with the bandit, bandit, and there's the count punish 6p from Jester. Side switch, okay. Pushes him into the top. That's Saint Cola praise mix. Fast slash 5H. Kill. I just wanted the buffs to Soul though. Is that his far hits are... Uh, has more combo potential now. Man, this neutral is interesting. They are all putting out... Both putting out buttons and like trying to catch each other. We see yet another air combo here from Milia. Oh no. Back dashes, goes for whiff punish. That's the mix. Close slash. Fast fall in. 2k duty, yeah. My god, the consistency. Jester is like. Just, it feels like Jester's screen is like. centered on sin and just is able to like just. Incredibly easily side switch. Close slash. Beautiful. Blocks. Oh my god. Going over, going low. Okay. Gets the throw. Again, this was like a fucking 70 second game, right? Like, they were playing a very neutral focused game and like trying to avoid each other a lot. And I like Sin sticking with the soul, having gone with the like um, si pocket character and like is willing to stick with it. I, I like that. I admire that. That is, I think, how those switches should be. Fastful careful, fastful careful again. Jump H, 2k 2d. Got him. There's the hair count. Gets the last Jager. Close slash. There's the wild throw, explosion. Oh my god. Close slash, like, oh my, staying on the same side of the, the goddamn fucking top for so long from just, was so smart. Like, I, I wish this was in YouTube so I could, like, go down and skip frame by frame here, like. I just still lost that one. Close slash, fast slash, 5H. Okay, yeah. Sees the opportunity, jumps out, gets the air to where, oh, punishes that burst. Good, and the heavy volcanic viper. 
this is the point of the video where me and Salin were like, yeah, soul combos are fucking cool. <laughs> because, man, soul combos really are cool. Like, there's, there's no fucking, no other way around it. Okay, so, both of the backdash at round start, which is why I'm not working on a bit too little sleep. That is an interesting strategy, actually, like, both going back. Going low. Got him. Oh, no. Just getting it. Whew. How the fuck did that 5k connect? I'm not gonna ask questions, but it, it definitely did connect. Going low. Man, Sin is moving pretty well here and like adjusting incredibly. Okay, yep, we're punishing that. Like, Jess is one of those players who I love seeing play and who I can never really understand. Because it's just going so fucking fast. Jester has the burst here, so when is it coming or is it coming at all? Jumping up BRCs to get the side switch. Blocks the burst from Sen. Jester saves the burst for next round. How the... How is this main so good? Oh, backdash, fast slash to get the punish. Incredible. Going low, okay. Jumping, getting him. Oh my god, beautiful. Going over, yeah. Got him, yeah. So, I was like, like, okay, the side switch went high, and then like, going in, gets hit, gets the knockdown, stays same side and low. So like, basically the opposite mix there. Man, I, 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 sim I simply, I need to watch more Jester, because else I won't be able to understand what the fuck's going on. Now, uh, last video where we saw uh, week 18, we saw Jester against Uriel as well, though that was in Loser's Final. But, at that point in time, Jester chose to go with the Axel. But, one, Jester lost 0-3 down. And Melee had just got buffed. Naguryuki just got buffed. We are in a new patch, and I love to, like, just stick with your character. Like, just to realize this, the pocket character has changed, our mains have changed, I should stay with the thing I'm most comfortable with here, and I adore that. We're going low. Yep. Punish. So, I feel like your strategy in this matchup is just, like, have incredible defense and punish this lady whenever you get a chance. That's the burst. Block the go slow because that's what it seemed like it would be. Man, uh, this is gets the counter hit fast slash pick up. Oh my god, the um, slash top immediately got, hit him out of the 2H. Oh my god, he's so patient. Go see, so this is the, the change in the new patch. So, Nagoryuki's DP changed. Yeah, so, 2K2D. So, 
after this, you now need to press the button for the follow-up, and you can wait long enough that the opponent has time to stop blocking in between, and that is what happened there. Tries to go for what looked like an air throw, and just a capled. I, I hear some biased commentary in the background, not sure how I feel about that. 2D. Slap that lady. Yeah. Yeah, this is looking rough for you. Why are see two H? So is this? There's the air combo. Just takes the game. Ah, it's the first game to Jester. Okay. So we start with 2k 6p here from Uriel. Jesus Christ. Close slash. The blocking. Oh my god. Just a you amazing player. Oh my love your reals offense here. Goes for the close slash immediately after B uh, uh BSU. Like he's like, okay, I can kill here. Good, goes for it. Oh my god. What what a monster Jester is here. Gets the mix going. Start Beyblade. Goes for the frame trap DP once again. It's we're three days in, you haven't gotten used to it yet. Like it. Got it. And no burst here from Uriel. Yeah. Yeah, I see that. Cause that was tired and it felt like Uriel's death was imminent. Oh my god. Two H. Oh my god. No, jumps into the top. That was either burst from Uriel, okay. I'm like trying to figure out how this neutral is working. It's a pick up from Jester. Caesar going in and like I feel like Uriel is very good at Uriel just has excellent defense here and I think that's really a big part of this because it feels like he is willing to like spend a lot of time blocking the mixes and when Jester is like oh he's blocking I can go for the throw Uriel is able to like get the hits oh yeah this is the is just to switch into Axel fake out, but just to just switch colors. God, fast full side switch. Like, what the fuck, Jester? Okay, it's the fucking bad moon here. What? Yes. Oh no. Oh, the air throw. Like just to not going for the wall break, but okay. Why I see BSU. Okay, that was so close. Just like Uriel is just able to win these scrambles that like happen. 
Like, this doesn't look convincing. You're just able to get some damage in slowly, and then... Like, yeah, he gets these hits, like, stray, but and, like, gets some pressure in. But Jester is able to evade it most of the time. Like, we're gonna see Jester, like, be ahead again here, yeah. Now Jester's back on the mix. And Jura is just like, okay, we need to survive here so we can get some sort of counter hit. Yep, sees a jump in, does the 5 feet. Punish that burst, red RC, pick up, take it. Like, this is very much Jura just like, blocking, blocking. Okay, I see an approach I can like, punish. And then does that, like... Uriel plays like a goddamn fucking actual samurai. It's kind of funny. That's 6p. Okay. That's the super. That's. Yeah. Well, baby, 2s, 5h, 5p, beautiful. Just, like, Uriel has such an interesting playstyle here, and it's used very well. Oh my god, battles! Did he battle spirit Fukio BSU? Like, he goes in, gets the dunk, then meaty, meaty battle spirit Fukio into the um, BSU. What in the fuck? Oh my, Jester, what the fuck is that curse that is movement? Okay, we're jumping. Hey, Julius is just like willing to like block for as long as he can. And then like try and wait for an opportunity to strike. Like he doesn't really make his own opportunities. He's like waiting for Jester to give them to him. Oh my, yeah, that was the edge shit to age. I I didn't have the time to do this when I was like watching it earlier. So jump in. Uh huh. Yes. Let's. Le yeah. Head. What? How does that even work? How, How does it work? So. That's the uh, salty UNLs stream Ural Legion special. Fuck, he, that main is so good. Like, I I'm not fucking kidding. Like, seriously, go check out his Twitter. Check out his Twitch stream where half of it's like eighty percent Spanish, but it's often worth looking at. I have learned a bunch of Nago shit from watching it, so it, it I think it's worth it. Um, he's also a seemingly pretty decent homie, so that's nice. Thank you for watching. It's been a joy. I am gonna run out for the day, cut this up and put it on YouTube. If you do, like, subscribe, whatever. Come play in Salty U tournaments. It, it's fun. I, I quite enjoy it. It's uh, We have a Discord server full of nice people. It's, it's sweet. And now, that is it for this stream. I may be back later. I, I, ooh, I might have to play some Nagari. Okay, we'll see how it goes. But for now... I must bid you adieu. Take care. Goodbye. I love you. Mwah.